welcome to Tamil Guitar Lessons. Uh, very happy to see you once again, guys. Uh, this is part two, which is a lesson. Part one is a reference video. Uh, I have collaborated with uh, one of the soulful singer called Basandra. Uh, suggested you to watch it a couple of times before learning the song. Uh, in the reference video, I have played that in half a step higher, which means uh, I have tuned half a step higher. That means uh, the E string was tuned to F. And A was A sharp, D was D sharp, G was G sharp, and B was C, and E was F. Right now I am in standard tuning. I am going to teach you in standard tuning. Uh, let's quickly jump in. It's a kind of easy song. It's not very very difficult. But to get the grip, uh, you know, the intro, it's a little bit tricky. So you have to practice. Uh, we have to spend time a little more. That's it. So place your finger on the second fret of the A string, which is fifth string. By the way, guys, the strings are numbered in this way: one, two, three, four, five, and six. And use your thumb for plucking five. I mean six, five, and four. And third string, use your forefinger. Middle string, use your ring. I mean second string, use your middle finger. First string, use your ring finger. Now place your middle finger on the 2nd fret of the 5th string and your ring finger on 2nd fret of the 3rd string. So what you have to do is pluck the 5th string and then add your pinky on the 2nd fret of the 2nd string. So it's like Hope you got it like this. And then we have to play open second string. So and then you have to plug the third string. Third string, second fret. So add your pinky, open second string, and then third string. So it goes like Repeat that. You gotta repeat that thrice and then play E minor and then pluck six, three, two, and then F sharp minor, six, three, two. By the way, we, we are not playing the Fifth and fourth string. You can play like that too. So six, three, two, and then F sharp minor. You can hold it in this way. We are not playing the fifth and the fourth, so you can hold it in this way too. I'm using my thumb to cover it up. So so when the first time I'm plucking like this, super nice and slow. And when I play this, when I play second time of the intro, I'm adding one note which gives a bit more of life. What I have to do is we have to play. Can you feel that? What I'm doing is instead of plucking, you add one more note, which is uh, the D note. You just plucking with your with your thumb. So five, four. Remaining same, so hope you got the difference. And same thing follows. So after playing that, so let me play from the beginning. So 
pretty much follows the same pattern after that G major chord it's nothing but hold the G major bar chord and if you don't know how to hold the G major bar chord I have put up a lesson regarding how to hold the bar chords you can check it out most probably I'll be posting the link below so it goes like G major I'm plucking six five two three six five two three one after that I'm plucking five three and two so it goes like A major and then B minor so it goes like so you have to note down the timing G playing six five two three one and then then play plucking five two and three it goes in a timing Slow down. Hope you got it, I guess. After playing G, I have to play A major. This is A major shape. I'm holding this way. A few people hold this way. Holds in this way, all the same. So A major, same pattern. Five, four, two, three, one. So five, four, two, three, one, and then B minor, five, four, two, three, one. So same. And then it's nothing but D major. Some people hold it in this way. Everything is fine as long as you can get the clear sound. So D major and this is B flat major or A sharp you can call it. And then you have to play D5 chord. Just play the fourth and third. Just hold your uh, just fret second fret of the third string and then play. Four and three, or else you can play and hold like this, and you can play only the these three strings, or else you can play only these two, or you can hold this way. and I finished with B minor 7 chord hold the B minor chord take off your pinky it becomes B minor 7 and you can add the 7th note over here too which is an A note we got it I guess so this is B minor 7 just adding your pinky on the 5th fret of the A string it gives you a nice blues sound hope you got it I guess practice art uh, do remove to subscribe and uh, practice regularly that's it peace